the producer told me I would be in a safe space and told me, you know, I'd be, yeah, I would be supported. So that's what I expected. <laughs> he didn't behave with me like he had, he has not behaved with anybody else like he did with me. This is sad, man. This is really sad. Amanda Seals is already going at Shannon Shaw. She went at the Breakfast Club. The Breakfast Club used to be the people that would always bring her up. I'm sure somebody asked Shannon Shaw, hey, can you have Amanda Seals up here? Let her say her piece. And she did. She went to the interview and said her piece. But I seen a clip of it. And when Shannon Sharp was talking to her about the kids that was teasing her or whatever, and he's like, yeah, but they kids, you know, don't hold it against them or whatever. She didn't like that. I knew when I seen that clip, she going to say something bad about Shannon Sharp soon. But, man, I, I didn't know it was going to be this soon. It was real quick. And this is the problem with Amanda Seals. And it truly is sad because she could have had a great career. Not on stage. She's not funny on stage at all. But, um, like, doing the comedic role in acting. She was good with that. She played that role good. You know, she played... Um, a good role in Insecure. I didn't see, you know, everything. I didn't, you know what I'm saying? I didn't watch Insecure, but I remember I had a chick at the time and she always used to come over and be like, cut it on Insecure, you know? So we would watch it. And I basically just look at the screen, you know, give it about 30 minutes. You know how it go. Then you start rubbing on the thigh, you know, and hey, but I would check it out. And I, and I didn't know who Amanda Seals was at the time, but I'm like, oh, they, they got a pretty good cast here. I remember thinking that. Like, yeah, all of these people is pretty good. You know, and uh, she she did a good job with that. And she could have continued to play the comedic relief role. And, you know, her career could have got bigger and bigger. But every time she get into it with somebody, she got problems with Issa Rae. Issa Rae put her on. She got problems with uh, how Shannon Sharp interviewed her. She can't really go to the Breakfast Club no more. Sound like she got problems with Charlemagne, and Charlemagne always looked out for her. But because he interviewed Candace Owens, people like, oh, you done turned. And it's people that's going to say the same thing about Shannon Sharp interviewing Amanda Seals. Like, yo, why are you doing that? Why are you helping her out? You know, that's what we do. We help each other out. But her attitude, and it ain't passion. She think it's passion. No, it's your attitude, how you act towards people. You know, even when things don't go right, you shouldn't be uh, very combative like how you is. And sometimes it's better to not say nothing at all. Even when you done been wrong, or felt like you done been wrong. Sometimes it's better to keep your head high and go, all right, and just keep it pushing. Put the distance in between you and that person or people and just keep it pushing. You know, but she don't understand it. And I hope she really get it before it get real bad. And she just be out, you know, lost in the sauce for real. Because the problem that I think she also going to run into, I don't know where she stay, but I can guess it's somewhere in California, probably L.A., somewhere out there. It's expensive. Then she want to be in that community. That's the other thing. She want to go to the parties. You know, she was talking about how she couldn't get to the parties and all of this stuff and don't nobody want to help us. So she want to be in the in crowd, <laughs> but everybody she come in contact with end up not liking it. And after a while, it ain't everybody. It's you. It ain't every job that ain't good. It ain't, um, you know, people just messing with you. No. It's you after a while, and that's the thing with Amanda Seals, man. But y'all let me know, what do y'all think about her? What do you think about her coming after Shannon Sharp after him giving her the platform to possibly get her hot again? He done had the hottest interview of the year, and he giving Amanda Seals the platform, and she turned around and say, Shannon Sharp played in her face. But y'all let me know what you think about Amanda Seals. As always, if this your first time here, make sure you sub to the channel. Check out the other content. Click that like button. Y'all be easy. Be safe. Peace.